How many times am I going to shoot this video? Okay. So, I've had a semi weird, don't really do want do don't really want to do anything kind of day, but I got through it and I'm still going through it right now. But I got a little downtime, so I wanted to make this video. I've been trying to make this video all day, but because I wasn't feeling good this morning for my own personal reasons, not gonna say what it is, but for my own personal reasons, I wasn't feeling good, so I wasn't feeling up for the video. So I tried to make the video several times. It didn't happen. This is my, I don't know how many attempts to do this video, but I figured since I had a moment, I'll do it. So here you go. Okay, so let's start with how my day's been. It's been okay. It's been productive. Um, this morning I woke up to a text from... I was put in a group chat with my old, like, me and Jill's old hospitality club. And, uh, I sound hesitant when I say that because the club kind of excluded me and Jill in a way. We were stuck with the crappy jobs. Nobody really talked to us. We didn't get any information about the group. Like, if the group was meeting, we weren't told about it. So that made us feel crappy. Um, there was nothing that we had done to be treated as such. But for whatever reason, we were excluded on multiple occasions. With competition coming around, I was asked... There wasn't a place for me to compete, but I was asked to take pictures of the events. Jill's a photographer. They know this. Why wasn't she invited with me? She wasn't. I get asked to dinner with the group because one of her, the teacher's old students from the group had suggested that we all get together and go have dinner on Tuesday night. Again, I was in the group chat. Where was Jill? And I checked this morning to see if they had put her in. And I was, like, looking on my text and seeing if she had texted me. Because normally she would. And being like, hey, did you get this? Or were you put in the group chat? You know, she wasn't in the group chat. Like, what? Why? Why was I put in the group chat, but she wasn't? Why? Makes no sense whatsoever. And that pissed me off. Second of all, the reason all of this is coming up now is because it really pissed me off this morning. <laughs> to know that she wasn't invited as I was. She was in the group helping this teacher before the group was even thought of. Yet, the group chats named the teacher Miss J's um, kids. And some of the people in the group chat that were invited, invited, weren't even in the group. Yet, Jill was in the group. And there's more than one witness to say that she was. Yet, me and Jill were excluded, but I was invited to this dinner that they want to have. Why? Why? So that pissed me off, and I was thinking about it today, and I think it didn't make my mood any better. So that pissed me off, and I asked Jill if she was, what she thought of the whole thing, and she's like, hell no, I ain't going. They've always excluded us from the group. I'm not going to a dinner, especially granted I didn't even get invited. I wasn't even mentioned or brought up. The only thing that was said was, uh, this student came to see me and suggested we all had dinner. And it was up to the students, the past students, to spread the word about the dinner. The only other person that would have mentioned Jill, by any means, is me. I would have been the only one, maybe... Unless they invited somebody else, our other friend. But I sincerely doubt it. Just because we haven't... I don't think the teacher has contact with her. Much less anyone else. Well, maybe Kat. But other than maybe two people... Jill would not have been included. And that pisses me off. Because it happened again with the whole 
competition thing. I was asked to be the photographer for the event, yet Jill's the photographer as well. Why can't I have her with me? And I asked why, we asked why she couldn't have been with me, and she's like, we only need one person. From what I remember, I believe that was the response she had given. And supposedly, I believe it was because I had already been asked. We had been in that group for two years. Jill had easily been in that group for two years. But when Letterman season came around, she wasn't even put up for one. The first two people to get their Lettermans were me and Kat. We were the first two people to get fitted for our Letterman jackets. They did it two at a time. And then the next two people were people, one newbie who why would the newbie get a letterman get be fitted for a letterman when she had just became a member of the group? So that pissed me off too. All of this is past news, but it's it's bringing all of it up and it's pissing me off all over again. So I don't understand to get back to the point. I don't understand why Jill and I were invited together. Why Jill wasn't invited by the group. And why this is I don't I don't understand it. I don't know why I don't get it. Of course when when Leatherman Letterman came in little bit when Letterman season came around and we all got our Lettermans Jill was supposed to get hers. Jill offered to have a price for the teacher to give her a price as to what the price would be for the jacket and accessories if need so. But honestly, she just wanted the jacket. So she had gotten, she didn't even get the jacket. She wasn't offered a price. She didn't, the teacher didn't even say, you know, it's this much for you to order your own. She didn't do any of that. And Jill did not get her Letterman jacket. But I did. It's at Jill's house. Y'all have seen me wear my Letterman jacket. And again, I've told this story before. But for those of you who don't know, that's the story. And you can always go back in my channel and see. I think the day or the day after I had gotten the jacket. I don't remember. And it may not even be up anymore because that was a really old video. But... I don't know. It brought everything up and then it made me all mad again. So, And I was not in any mood whatsoever to be more mad. So you can imagine how that made me feel this morning. And I'm sure how it made Jill feel as well. Because she was like, hell no, it's not happening. I have an appointment that day. Plus, on top of that, I have an appointment that day. And granted the fact that we weren't, we were very much excluded from the group on multiple occasions... It's not happening. We're not going to dinner. Or she's not going to dinner. But I also am not going to that dinner. No. It's not happening. So that's that rant. That's a, that was like an eight minute rant about that. But. The rest of my day I went to work. I did a ten to one shift. I came home. I did some chores. Took about ten minutes. From like late 3 to 2 o'clock was when I got done. And it's 3.19. Oh wait, I got done at 3, not 2. I started at... No, wait. Doesn't matter. That's how it doesn't matter. I had gotten done with the chores. Some of them. I still got a few more things to do. Like I gotta clean this room. Our room. I gotta do our laundry. I got a few other things to do. Other than that... You know. Pretty normal. Nothing to report. Everything went fine. I got on the bus fine. No arguments with the bus today. Everything's been fine. But that group chat thing pissed me off. And she's still texting me about it. So, 
that's what I don't understand about that. But other than that, I had a pretty decent day. It was a beautiful walk. It was a long walk. And my body was about ready to give out because, nope. I am tired. <laughs> but it was my last client of the week until next week. So I get a little downtime. It's always good. So I'm going to take advantage of that downtime. And just do that. I need a nap. <laughs> Other than that, pretty normal day. That's the update. I'm just going to chill in this closet and maybe watch a video or two. Before I go back into the room. I mean, I'm in the room, but I'm in the closet. Does that make sense? I don't know. It's nice and relaxing in here. But I'm going to just chill for a minute and then get back to work on the chores. And then... I don't know what I'm going to do from there. Maybe eat. Maybe. And just go about the rest of my day. Call Jill. I gotta call her tonight. Call my mother. I gotta call her tonight. But yeah, that's it. Bye.